The Idea Lab is a day for hearing from experts, thought leaders, activists, and creative storytellers. An entire day to think about big ideas and new stories. What I wanted to do is figure out a way to capture people's imagination to really understand the invisible world. There's over a million bacteria per cubic meter in the air in this room. Our microbes play an important role in regulating our immune system, our metabolism. We are creating an entirely new branch of the economy. The era of cheap is over and the era of smart has just begun. The ways in which we should use to design to promote a certain civic and civil sustainability. What do you think works and what doesn't work? Food affects everyone, and unlike climate change, which is mostly experienced as weather, it's something everyone engages in and talks about daily. A lot of people, though they might believe in climate change, don't think that individual action could make a difference. And I'm here to try to give you a little bit of hope. I would have never known that eating a rabbit is so much better than eating a sheep, or that a sheep was as bad as an industrial cow. I would argue that cities and the mayors are going to be much more important in the next four years than the federal government. We also have the opportunity to repurpose all of the space that we're wasting on storing vehicles. It's sit 94.8% of the time. So imagine what our streets could look like. I mean, you're talking about a completely different way of life, only one broken down Chevette on every street. Push is really rooted in the values that I believe in. That we also have the opportunity to be self-determining an openness to experimentation, a commitment to resident-led development, recognition that climate change is demanding new levels of resilience and conservation, and our commitment to ironclad equity. People will feel the impact of climate change most profoundly through water. One of our technologies can see into these trees and measure the amount of water in every single tree we fly over. Trees that you see here in blue are doing just fine, and trees that are in red are wicked dry and are ready for something bad, maybe a fire to break out and burn those. So the photo arc, as we call it, we're using these black and white backgrounds as a great equalizer to try to get all animals an equal footing or an equal say. The goal is to make all creatures, great and small, valuable in people's eyes, and to get people to just look animals in the eye and fall in love with them, or to think that they're weird or interesting or anthropomorphic. Whatever it takes to get them into the tent of conservation and get them to realize that there's value here. Save the date to join us for the 2017 Innovation Idea Lab.